bands to make a dance. Bands to make a dance. These cheeks clapping and they ain't using hands. Hey, hey, oh! Hello my lovely Morbid Thoughts, welcome back to my channel, it's Morbid Gamer. If in case you haven't realized, I am decked out in like pink head to toe and background. But that is besides the point. Today we're going to be talking about a new added feature to Wicked Whims. Now I recently covered Wicked Whims on my channel, so if you haven't checked out that video, check it out so you're like all up to date with all the extra features that Wicked Whims brings to the table. And this is just an added bonus that we're gonna look at today. So it is actually gentlemen clubs have been added to Wicked Whims and that's just the like a PG way of putting things but yeah basically you can now own your very own strip club in the game Yay! you can run it hire employees all that jazz we're gonna take a look at it in depth but I do want to mention that this is a patreon early access right now it is in beta so I know turbo driver still wants to add so much to this a new feature but it will probably be out for release somewhere down the line turbo driver always releases it out for free to the public i just wanted to mention that and leave a link down below to turbo drivers patreon as well as the wicked whims website if you want to check it out now before we get started public service announcement if you are not subscribed to the channel why the heck not it is completely free click that little red button if you haven't already also turn on your notifications so you can become part of the early squad not only that give this video a like help your girl out help me out you like me why not also if you want to go above and beyond check out the little join button or the link down below in the description to check out the extra channel perks that you get if you decide to pay a monthly subscription to the channel but like no pressure or whatever but we're just gonna dive right into this let's look at this mod a little bit closer shall we so here we are with my sim. What we're gonna do first is actually come over here to this computer very quickly. We are actually going to apply for a loan because we need a strip club. Of course, we're gonna start a business and for that we need a loan. If you hear noise in the background, that is my cat and I'm so sorry, <laughs> but he likes to play. So a loan was approved. So next what we're gonna do now that we're sticking rich is go to the phone and click on the household tab. Go to buy a strip club mostly everything on this mod is work through the phone actually of course you're gonna have to need to put down a nightclub a strip club any kind of club or you could just buy a lot you know and then build your own strip club whatever it may be but we're gonna purchase this one that i downloaded off of the gallery it's not mine but it's the beast nightclub and we're gonna go ahead and purchase it now that we're here at our new owned business legit business you'll see that on my left <laughs> it says use phone to manage the club anything that you do when it comes to the strip club and owning one and running the business actually you're not gonna deal with the usual like business tab over here if you have uh, get to work you're actually gonna do everything from your phone. Everything is done from your phone. You should have a new tab down here. It's called Strip Club now. So cute. But we're gonna wanna change some stuff. So according to what it is that you want. I'm gonna manage uh, open hours and I'm gonna change them from 7 p.m. I want it open a little bit earlier. So we're gonna do 6 p.m. till about 3 a.m. in the morning. Now we have our set times. Next, what I'm gonna wanna do is manage employees. Cause of course we need strippers. We need people to work the floor. We need people to dance, give lab dances. We need bar, like a bartender. We need all that to run a proper strip club. So right down here, you're gonna notice that immediately people have certain skills like when hiring anybody. So this lady clearly has charisma. So I'm gonna go ahead and hire her. Age ain't nothing but a number. Whoa, Sandy is really good at uh, bartender, so I think we found our bartender. Oh, Ted Roswell, he is one of those freaks from Strangerville. Why the heck not? We trying to get freaky deaky anyways, so yes to him. We need a couple more ladies. Let's say Destiny. That sounds like a stripper name, so let's go with Destiny. Let's go with George. George also has pretty good charisma. And I think that's it for now. Now, the next thing that we're probably going to want to do is 
design our female and male outfits. Now, this is where it gets a little bit fun. Now, we can't go too crazy, obviously. Um, we're gonna think more <laughs> formal, more uh, expensive, high-end strip club. Basically, censored strip club. <laughs> so, we're not trying to get demonetized, even though we probably will. But we're definitely not trying to get this video taken down. What we want is probably something like this. This can work. Let's go with let's go with red because the club is that is a theme. It is the beast nightclub, a gentleman nightclub, if you will. And of course, we need some very very tall heels. So here is our first outfit for our female employees. And for the guys, I do want a more gentlemanly look. And that is perfect. That is exactly the look that I am going for for my male sims. Now, of course, we have to assign the outfits that we just designed. So for my ladies, you all get your work and uniform. And for my male sims, you also get your uniforms. There you go. Now, when opening your club, there are certain things that you do have to do, and that is adding poles, stripper poles, dancing spots, lab dancing seats to your club, or else things just won't work like a strip club would. So you need, of course, a pole. It is in build by Wicked Strip Club Dancing Pole. You'll need, and you'll drop that down wherever you want. I have two set up already. There is also a dancing spot for dancers there's the wicked strip club dancing spot marker so i'm gonna place it down right there so that one of my dancers can go ahead and dance on that spot last but not least you are gonna need like a love seat a chair a seat a whatever have you and you're gonna have to mark it as a, a lap dancing spot so that people know where to go for that so we're gonna assign that one and this one you could also make it a private room we do have a private room over here as well whatever works for you now it is recommended that you seal off your dancers and your strippers and all that but for the sake of this video we're just going to test out how that works when you leave open spaces but it is recommended so people sit and actually watch the dancers as well as tip and you know spend their cash money on them throw dollar dollar bills or what have you so i think we're ready almost ready over here at the bar you'll see that it says bar supply status you actually have to buy supplies for your bar um once you run out or get low you can no longer sell any kind of alcoholic drinks to your sims alcoholic drinks um, you can also order supplies once you're running low, once you need some. At the moment, we don't. Uh, but you can also mark your drinks either from all the way from 0 to 100%. And for the sake of this video, we're just going to mark the bejesus out of these drinks. So we're going to go out to 100. My sim chose the worst time to be on her period. Oh my god. Uh, don't worry, girl. I got you. I got you. I can't leave you hanging. Hey, girl, girl. Take this. Be well. All right. She's good now. She's ready to be a little strip owner, a gentleman's club owner. We are now open for business, but one thing that I forgot to do was go into the settings for Wicked Whims. We actually changed some strip club settings. You can, there's a lot that you can mess with, but one thing that I really want to do is dancer profit share percentage. So you can change that from zero to 20%. That's how much your dancers are going to share with the club, how much they're gonna give back to you. So they give you 20%. So you can change that to zero, whatever you feel just. I'm gonna go ahead and I'm gonna rob my dancers of all their money and we're just gonna go for 100%. We gotta make a living out here. I'm sorry. We, there is a personal lap dance cheat as well. So we're gonna turn that on. So I find that sometimes the dancers can get a little stuck and they just won't really do much. So this way you can force them and you can cheat them to do things. Like you can actually make them work. So now that we're open for business, it, it we're closing at 3 a.m. Good to know. Where are my employees? Now I'm pretty sure that you can hire yourself even as a dancer but uh at the moment it's not giving me the option and i don't know how to tweak the settings to allow that to happen but you can actually uh hire yourself and work your own club also now my dancers are here they're sitting down 
I'm gonna have just force uh, some of my workers to actually come in and work <laughs> so we can check out some of these animations. They're pretty good also. She is an alien. What's her name? Sandy. Sandy, you get it, girl. You work it. All that. Girl, I know that is not the uniform. How dare you show up in no uniform? Oh, I just realized I never gave her her uniform. Whoops, that's my bad, actually. She is a new employee. <laughs> not everyone's got their proper outfit. Everyone's working. These animations are actually pretty legit. We have one stage dancing over here. We have Grandma over here on the other one. We've got someone over here butt naked giving somebody else a dance. Plus another one, Sandy over here. I'm giving another dance. So everyone's over here making me all that coin, all that money. Dance to make a dance. Dance to make a dance. These cheeks clapping. And they using hands. Hey, hey, oh, she felt the alien felt that. Oh, you, mm, my girl, thank you. Now, a part of me does think that when you section off the areas, it tends to work a little bit better. Um, at least from what I'm seeing. Oh, never mind. She just spent some money. So I guess not always, but I do think sectioning it off just works a little bit more. And maybe just having one main stage uh, for your dancers, because it seems like they're only going to be attracted to one particular one. If you have two, I don't think it's going to work as well. So I'm actually going to stop granny over here because she ain't making me no money, no type of money. So I need you to stop dancing and actually come back here and give somebody else a dance. Grandma, why don't you give grandma a dance? And that is what she's going back there to do. Now you stopped. I need you to keep work. Everybody needs to keep working, okay? I need to make money. <laughs> I honestly don't know how much uh, money people make off of this, off of dances. It'd be nice to know, but I actually don't even, I, I don't really know. Oh girl, that moves, that leg, it looks so good. Look at her go. So again, everything is done off of your phone. So you can go ahead if you ever need to look at your financial report because this one doesn't, this one over here doesn't really tell you much. Uh, it's gonna be over here. This one's gonna give you all the details, everything really, how much you've lost, made, how things are going. My god, Grandpa Henry, no! Y'all are making me no money over here. So I'm gonna need you to stop. I'm gonna take this stripper pole away. Y'all can't get enough. Bye! I'm gonna need you to come over here and give a dance. Come get with it. Also, if you ever feel like there's not enough people in your club, you can go back to settings, go to nudity settings, go to strip club settings, and then scroll to where it says static client count sheet. You can actually cheat the amount of people that are in your club at a time. There is a certain time where your club is the most full, but if you want it full like all the time, you can't cheat it. Um, I would suggest going at about like maybe somewhere between one to about 10, um, depending on your computer. If you go 30, I, that's that's more reserved for like higher end pcs that can have that many sims in one lot but i'm gonna go 20 just for the sake of this video and we're gonna see if we can get some a little bit more people in here it's already 11 and i feel like it's a little bit dead for the night it is thursday like we all know that nothing really happens on a thursday come on now that's right everybody make me money bartenders working stage dancers dancing Pole dancers, pole dancing, uh, lab dancers be lap dancing. It's great. I better see a revenue after this. Everybody's getting fired. Got to rule with an iron fist, man. And again, if your Sims ever like stop doing anything, you want them to keep working, there is the cheat. So you just click on anything, click on the Sim and a client, whoever, let's go with Diego Lobo. And your Sim will start working again because they kind of just stand around sometimes and i need money <laughs> also this is good more sims have spawned all right so the cheat kind of worked and we're getting more people up in here but be cautious be wary of the cheat depending on your like computer oh no no i'm losing one of my strippers to those strangerville freaks oh who's gonna bartend now yeah we lost him Great, great. I hate those stranger bill freaks. Uh, okay, sir, I'm gonna need you to, you're not doing anything. I need you to bartend really quick. I don't think that you're able to tend your own bar. I think the sim, it just doesn't register with the sims in the club. They just, they will not order from you. I've tried that. <laughs> so I wish there was a way for you to be able to uh, 
just be able to attend your own bar, you know? Why not? Yes, more people. You are all very welcome. I hope you find my establishment is up to par. <laughs> all the best of day. Oh no. Okay, so we finally closed out for the night. We made total revenue of 393. Bar total profits was 148. Dancer tips total profit cut 245. So that was our cub, all the tips that the, our strippers made. And even still, we did not manage to cover that much of the wages. So um, I think that this mod still has a little bit more tweaking to go, especially because I've noticed that you don't make that much money off of the nightclub, of, of, of having a gentleman's club. You can't, not, not yet at least. I think it needs a little bit more tweaking. I think the numbers need to be tweaked around a little bit more i think um tips should be made a little bit you know some people spend like some people are cheap some people spend like a dollar some people spend like ten dollars twenty maybe but there's some people that spend like actual like you know racks on racks on racks on strippers so we need a bigger margin is what we need because i'm covering it right now but we've only made 81 uh, simoleons like what what how are we gonna live off of that how am i gonna pay my sims rent guys how so it, it does need a little bit more tweaking but for the most part i think this mod is really uh well done especially with the animations the people the the hiring the designing of the like outfits the uniforms um i think it's, it's well researched thought out it just needs a little bit more enhancing and improving which is I think exactly where this mod is at the moment. Oh my god, I see that Stranger Veil freak over there. But I think that's exactly where this is. Uh, it's in beta and it's not perfected yet. But again, if you do want to check it out, I'll have a link down below so you guys can if you want to. If not, that's okay too. But I hope you guys enjoyed coming along with me and this mod. <laughs> it's really fun to play. I think I covered everything. Leave any questions, comments, or whatever, maybe down below in the comments. Let me know what you guys think. But that's about it for this video and I will see you all in my next one. So bye for now.